Selecting and configuring a Garmin GHP-10 Autopilot to fit your powerboat is simply a matter of matching the recommended hydraulic pump to the standard core pack and then adding control options as desired. Choices are as simple as one, two, three. Step one, start with the core pack. The GHP-10 Autopilot consists of five main components, four of which are included in the standard core pack. First up, the Course Computer Unit, or CCU, is the brains of the system. It contains the sensory equipment used to determine the boat's heading and speed. The Course Computer connects to the Electronic Control Unit, or ECU, and to the GHC-10 display. Full NEMA 2000 network compatibility makes installing these system components easier and faster than ever. The last component of the core pack is Garmin's exclusive Shadow Drive electronic flow sensor that installs in the hydraulic steering lines of your boat. It activates when the helm is turned manually, disengaging the autopilot. When the rate of turn zeroes out on a new heading, the GHP-10 re-engages automatically and resumes steering. Step two is selecting the right pump. A variety of hydraulic pumps are offered to match the specific requirements of almost any hydraulically steered boat. The pump is not included in the core pack because the size and type of steering system on your boat determines what pump you'll need. With steering ram capacities ranging from six to 25 cubic inches and pumps designed to fit both balanced and unbalanced steering systems, Garmin can equip just about any boat with the ideal pump for the job. To ensure selection of the proper pump for your autopilot, please refer to the boat manufacturer's specifications or consult with your Garmin Marine dealer. Step three is all about adding those optional controls or accessories you might want. For example, if you'd like the freedom to move about on deck without being tied down, Garmin's optional GHC-10 wireless remote lets you control the autopilot from distances up to 45 feet away. Also, if your boat has multiple helms, Garmin makes it easy to add a control head at each helm station. As many as three GHC-10 control heads can be connected via NEMA 2000 standard networking. Like I said, Garmin makes tailoring the right autopilot system for your boat and your budget as simple as one, two, three. Thanks for watching, and we hope you'll stay with us as our series continues with more in-depth details on how to install and operate the Garmin GHP-10.